Finally tonight, one for the medical books. It began when a young girl went in for a liver transplant. What happened to her is nothing short of amazing. Here's Richard Schlesinger. What are the odds that any transplant patient could end up like Demi Brennan of Sydney, Australia? They're next to impossible. I feel like a normal person. She's 15 now, but six years ago she had a liver transplant. Major surgery, but pretty routine. What happened next, some people are calling a miracle. We didn't believe it. <laughs> we, we, we thought that this was just too strange an occurrence to occur. Most patients have to take strong medications to prevent their bodies from rejecting donated tissue. But Demi's body is different. It not only accepted the donated liver, it actually adopted the immune system, even the blood type of the donor. When it first brought to the, by the lab staff to, the, to my colleague and said, this girl's blood group's gone from O negative to O positive. You know, first of all, we thought we must have made a mistake. You know, It's never happened before. We think she's a, a one in six billion kind of a girl. Somehow she did what doctors have been trying to do ever since they started performing transplants, get the body to stop trying to reject donated organs. The holy grail of transplant was achieved, and that's, that's what we were trying to achieve um, for everybody, but Demi's body had, had done that herself. So now doctors will be studying her case to see if they can unlock the secrets of Demi's astonishing achievement. It's like my second chance at life. She looks and says she feels just like any other healthy 15-year-old girl. Mm -hmm. Purple hair, green nails, and feeling in the pink. Richard Schlesinger, CBS News, New York.